Hey, good morning, Side Hustling family. How's it going? If you've never heard of the Side Hustling family, click the subscribe button below to join our little family. But y'all are hungry and y'all wanna make some money and y'all trying to find out ways to do it in your free time and in the comfort of your own home. Well, luckily, I got you covered. So if you can read, you can definitely take part in this you're going to be getting paid to read books well enough so you people want to hear you and you get paid decently for that. So what am I talking about? Let's get into it right now. what's going on if you've never seen me before i'm cat theo and on my channel we think about very non-traditional ways to make a little bit of an extra income we talk about work at home we talk about investing we talk about money stuff all day every day feel free to like this video if you can use some more money in your life so today we're talking about how you can get paid to essentially read and use your voice to make you some money. In my last video, I talked briefly here in this video about becoming a voiceover artist. Essentially, you use your voice, you read stuff, and you can use your voice to make money. This is something very similar into this, but now I'm gonna go into detail how to actually do it, how to get money. So not only am I saying you should go become a voiceover artist, but to actually show you websites so you can do it yourself. So essentially you have lots of authors constantly creating books and you can expand upon the audience you reach when you have an audiobook. So currently I'm an author myself. I'm an author of a children's book, Lila Escapes the Zoo. And this book is something that I have on audio as well. I found a voiceover artist to be the voice of my book to be the character in my book and it turned out really really well and I love everything she did and she really brought my character to life so you have hundreds and thousands of books being published every single year every single week and these people want to have a voiceover artist to bring their book to life I know a lot of you guys have listened to podcasts or you listen to books on on your drive to work audible and stuff like that so essentially that voice you are hearing can be your voice, it can be you. So I'm gonna show you right now how to do that. Okay, so you're going to go to the website acx.com and this website you can see, they have audiobooks that have been sold through huge online retailers like Audible, I'm sure you have maybe heard of Audible, Amazon, obviously you've heard on, and iTunes. So big reputable company, so you're just gonna scroll down here and you're gonna be an actor or producer. So you are gonna be using your voice to make money. So you're just gonna click that here. And now you're gonna search for titles open for audition. So you're just gonna say, find a book for your voice. Here are all the books of authors that need a voice and are looking for a voice to be the voice of their book. And they're looking for maybe your voice. Why not your voice? So you can see there are 2,740 titles right now from the time that I'm filming this video. So there are thousands of options. So what are the chances of you getting one or two or three of these? I think pretty high as these are being added to every single day. So one time my book was on here. So pretty fun to be on the other side of it. So you can search by genre. So if you're somebody that's into a specific type of genre, then you can click genre here and you can do kids, for example, since that was the industry I was in. You have 35 titles just in the kids. So if you have a kind of a goofy voice that you can kind of make sounds higher or lower or sound like a boy or a little girl, you know, this could be a great option for you. You can also filter it by male or female, depending on what they're looking for. So 1900 people, 1900 books need a female and the others are male. So that's awesome. You can obviously do language. So I'm going to do English. So we still have 1700 options. So you can also filter through voice style. I would say my voice style is, oof, I don't know, hip, hip, 
feminine? I don't think so. Maybe engaging, let's try engaging. 230 options are still available. All right, so once you find your ideal book, I'm just gonna choose this iPhone guide user because I feel like that's pretty standard. You're gonna be able to audition for it. So you can look now at the genre, the language, all these details that they're looking for on here. You can take a look at the book on Amazon itself to see if it's something you like. So the estimated length of this book that you're gonna be reading is a total of three hours. The total words you're gonna say is 27,688. And the project budget for this one is actually a royalty share. So how many books they sell, you'll get a royalty. So if you're kind of looking for this long term, you can make more money than if you were just to do the flat fee. But just for the sake of this video, let's just go back and do the flat fee because I think most people, they're gonna be mostly interested in that. Okay, I found this book. It's called, If You're Reading This, the estimated time it will take you to read it is nine hours. And the cool thing about this project budget, they're sharing a royalty share or a royalty share plus 200 to 400 per finished hour. Okay, so this is actually a really, really, really great one because you can do the royalty share, which is a reoccurring fee that you'll get. So no matter how many books they sell, you're gonna get some kind of money back. Plus, they're also gonna pay you 200 to $400 per finished hour. Hour. So you can see there's nine hours. You can do the math there. So let's do on the low end, nine times $200 is $1,800. And then on the high end, nine times 400 is $3,600. So I will say that it's not gonna be a straight nine hours that you're gonna put into this. It's probably gonna be a little bit more because you're not gonna like the way you said something, you're gonna have to redo it. So it's probably an extra hour, hour and a half on there. So do think about that, but this one's actually a really great option. So I do wanna talk about the pros and cons of doing just royalty share or just a straight fee. Not very often you will see both of these where you have royalty share plus an hourly, because this is awesome. So the benefit of a royalty share is you do the one time and you're getting money every single month for the rest of your life. So it's awesome. Whereas if you just get the flat fee, you know, let's just say it's 200 bucks an hour, you get that flat fee. However, you have to always be doing more and more audiobooks to be able to keep making money. So it's just really a preference. You can also do a variety. The con of the royalty share is if the book actually doesn't sell, you might not actually make really any money or make it really worth your time. So it really just depends on how well the book does. That's why you should look it up on Amazon to make sure that the book is something that's actually selling. If they only have one review, it's probably not a book that's actually gonna make you any money if you only are doing royalty share. All right, so once you see that this is something you wanna do, so let's just say that this is the book you wanted to do, you're gonna to wanna to audition. So right here is the audition script. You're gonna download that script and essentially you're just gonna read it, send it over to them and they're gonna choose. So there are usually a few people that apply. So maybe you and like four other other voiceover artists are gonna apply through this and they're just gonna pick their favorite run. So you wanna be auditioning quite often. It's just like any other audition. If you've ever acted or anything like that, you're gonna have to audition and whoever makes the cut makes the cut. All right, so another thing I wanted to mention is obviously the equipment. If this is something you wanna do professionally, this is something you're really interested in, and maybe you have a great voice, maybe you have an engaging voice or whatever, some things you need to consider getting is a soundproof studio. Right now, you can hear that I'm talking, there's a little bit of an echo. If you're gonna be a voiceover artist, you cannot have that echo, it's not professional. You're gonna also wanna have a very professional microphone. So there are microphones. I personally like this one called Zoom. It's very high quality, it's like $150, so really not too bad, and it's very, very professional. There's tons on Amazon. Something will definitely come up for you, it's Amazon. <laughs> they have everything. So those are the, the things you wanna be investing in is a microphone that's high quality and obviously soundproofing your area, and also make sure that you don't have echoes or noises, you can't hear your dog barking in the background, you can't hear anything going on in the background. So obviously people that have success with this are people that have a professional microphone and a professional space, but if this is something you wanna do professionally, you can also 
do custom voiceovers on Fiverr. I talked about that in my last video. You can also find work on Upwork as a voiceover artist. So there is definitely a lot of options for you in the voiceover sphere. If you're a singer and you make your own melodies and your own lyrics and your own beats, you can start doing that on Fiverr. You can start doing that on Upwork and that makes pretty good money too. All right, well, that's all I have for you today for if you know how to read and you know how to speak and you speak well, you can make money online using your voice. So I think you can see how many options you have as a voiceover artist and all the things you can do, but hopefully this website at least gives you an option to get started if you have no idea where to start and you're kind of dabbling in Fiverr and not having so much luck. Hopefully this is another option for you just to add to your collection of options. Well, feel free to like this video, comment down below, have a conversation with me. And if you haven't already, subscribe to the family to join our little side hustling family. We have videos like this every single week. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.